Hey, how's it going? My name is Doug Doherty. I live in downtown San Diego. I uh, appreciate you taking the time out of your day to watch this video that I made for you. Um, I wanted to give you an idea of your position on Google and to see if new prospects can actually find uh, your business on the internet. All right, so as you can see, we're on my business page. My company is Amp Local. We do web design and we are experts in SEO. All right, I just want to jump straight into the video here. All right, so as you can see, we're on your website, Executive Motor. So 80% of people uh, in the world, when they need a city, uh, when they need a product, when they need a service, um, they're going to use Google. All right, Google's the most popular way to get information on the Internet. All right, um, so they're going to go to Google, and they're going to type in the city and the service of the product. So to find you, they would have to search used cars San Diego. All right, so there's many keywords. There's used cars, auto sales, um, things of that nature, but actually used cars, uh, according to Google Analytics, is the most popular search uh, to get you the most revenue and the most business. So you want to be at that at the top of that search, all right? So it looks like January is going to have nearly 4 million hits for used cars in Google, all right? So very important. So used cars San Diego, that's how they're going to find you. So I searched you here, and you, you're on page 5, um, and you're ranked. Let's see, XM Motors... You're ranked number 45 right here, okay? Number 45. So let me show you this chart real quick. This this shows you who gets all the traffic and all the business from that Google search. The number one ranked person gets 34% of that total market. Number 15 gets barely 1%, all right? And just to remind you back here at number 45, all right? So there's 200 determining factors in Google's algorithm, okay? Determine if you're the most relevant and who gets the best ranks pretty much. All right, so I could sit up, sit here and talk to you about them all day, but I'm just going to talk to you about four of the most very important ones. All right, the first one I want to talk to you about is content. All right, so when we go to your web page, is there authoritative content on your web page? Do you have ample amount of information that is relevant to used cars for sale in San Diego? All right, is that repeated many times? Is that elaborated? Okay, so I'll go to your web page. Um, you have good. Uh, tabs here to break up your website to navigate but this is what Google's looking at right here your home page and this content you have three little paragraphs here okay of information so it's imperative again to have you want to have 1,000 to 2,000 words let me give you a great example so went to Google typed in elephant you can type in anything all right look what's number one Wikipedia let's click on that real quick all right so Wikipedia is notorious for popping up number one on these searches. Why? Because look at this page. Authoritative content. All has to do with elephants. Relevant material to the topic, okay? We can scroll for days. This is probably 20,000 plus words. I'm going to scroll all the way through it. I just want to give you an idea. Again, authoritative content. 1,000 to 2,000 words on your home page to be competitive against your competitor. All right, next what I want to talk to you about are listings. Okay, we also call these citations. These are very important. This is how we get our product and our service out on the market. All right, so some examples of these are Yahoo, Facebook, Bing, Yelp, Yellow Pages, and White Pages. All right, there's thousands of these. All right, so when we do listings or citations, um, it's imperative to have our business name, address, and phone number identical across all the platforms because if not, Google's going to give us a low ranking and slap us on the hand. Okay, so it looks like you have 55% error rate. Let's look into that a little bit. It looks like your business name is varied. Your address is varied and your phone number is varied through the listings that you have. And then also, look at these listings. You're not even listed, okay? So I guarantee you there's um, prospects looking for used cars in San Diego in these listings that can't find you, okay? So you want to be listed in all those. Like I said, there's thousands. We want to be in actually three, four, even 500 of them to be competitive with your competitors, right? Here are the top 50. Definitely want to be in these, okay? Guarantee you clients are looking for use cars in San Diego using these listings or directories, okay? Like I said, there's thousands of these. You actually want to be in three to four, even 500 to be competitive and to beat your competitors, okay? A lot of these are free. It's just time consuming and getting the right information in there, okay? Next thing, mobile friendly. 60% of people looking for products or service in that city are actually going to use their iPhone, Android, smart device, okay? Um, so it's imperative to look good on a smart device and something Google takes into account. So your site, for various reasons, is not mobile friendly. Okay? So uh, Google's slapping you on the hand for that one. Last thing I want to talk to you about. 
backlinks. We also call these citations, okay? So backlinks, um, say you get a client which is thoroughly impressed with your customer service and your products and your, and your cars, okay? Which I'm sure happens all the time. Um, say they have a website or they're a blogger and they write articles and stuff to that nature. They're going to go to their website and actually post an article about you and your business and, your, and the great customer service wanting to recommend all their family and friends to, to you. All right, so anyone reading that article, uh, what, what would happen is they're going to put a direct link from your website on their website. So anyone reading the article can actually click the link and go to your website and become a prospect and may potentially buy something from you. In Google's eyes, this is huge, okay, because this counts as a vote. This is probably the number one thing that's going to get you organically ranked right here as number one for used car San Diego. Remember the listings with the 55% error rate? All right, this is responsible for getting you on the Google map listings right here to see your business, okay? So, um, a lot of information. I hope some of this answered some questions on what SEO is. You know, SEO pretty much is just what you say about your business and what everybody else on the internet says about your business. So, um, I also have a piece of technology I want to share with you. Um, I call it the power call system. Say you get an email, okay? Uh, uh, someone, a prospect gets to your website, um, they email you, you know, they want a quote on a 2012 Nissan Altima, okay? What happens is um, that email, my system converts that email into a direct call to you or your sales rep, and the sales rep accepts the call, then the system automatically calls that new prospect. So this happens within 45 seconds, and that time is um, changeable depending on how, we, how you like to have it set up. Um, but this is huge because according to Google Analytics, 41% of business owners actually lose business to new prospects because of unanswered or unfollowed up email requests. All right, so never again will you have to learn, uh, worry about answering back a client that emailed you. Um, you can hit that prospect, get them in your store, close that deal, get that revenue immediately. Okay, so again, I appreciate the time you took to watch this video. Um, if any of this makes sense for you and your business, I'd love to have a conversation with you about it. I included my, my number, my email uh, address. also wrote up a proposal, and I included my products and services with all the details of everything that I can do for you and your business. Again, appreciate your time. You have a nice day.